Welcome to Everyday Life and Money Matters. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, I just wanted to share some valuable information with you about how you can go about creating your KDP self-published book. I know some of you may have been having difficulties generating your content for your book. You may be having writer's block. Well, ChatGPT is here to assist you. So what is ChatGPT? It is a free artificial intelligence chat box that can assist you on your journey as a self-publisher. So you want to go to Google, type in chat, O-P-E-N-A-I. And once you have done that, it would prompt you to create an account. Once you have created an account, you can start the chat process. So as you can see, I am on the ChatGPT board. So let's get straight into how this can assist you as a self-published author. So I'm going to put table of contents for a short story about two friends at the beach and you select enter now once you select enter you would see that it is making progress already in terms of what your table of contents should look like for your book right so we want to expand on the same topic you can put introduction Or main characters in storybook about two friends at the beach, and you see that enter. And you will have to scroll down. And as you scroll down, you would see that we have an introduction. So already, guys, I am so interested in this story book and these main characters. So you are getting the ideas you need to develop the content for your self-published book. So where you may be stuck or where you need to generate additional content for your book, chat. Open AI is available to assist you. So let's look at another avenue that we can use this form of artificial intelligence to create a self-published book. So let's say you want to create a book about leadership in your country or country leaders rather. Let's type in, as I said, table of contents or book about leaders in let's see africa and you select enter and you can see it's generating the information for you already right so this helps to make your task easier in terms of layout in terms of what you should include and what you should not include in your self-published book and just like the first option, you can go through the table of contents and see what is being suggested. And then you can ask for guidance or information relative to a particular point. So let's just put in Profiles about current leaders. Let me put contemporary. Contemporary leaders in Africa. And again, you press enter. And to see what it's generating, you can simply scroll. And as we see, we are getting the information immediately. 
So this takes out a lot of the hassle and the research that you may need to do when making these type of educational books. But definitely you guys should still do your research to make sure that the information that is suggested in the artificial intelligence is in fact accurate. And just how we did that for point three in the table of contents, you can do that for all the different points and generate your entire book. So I'm just gonna take a synopsis from this point three. And let's check to see whether or not the information is plagiarized. And we're just going to paste the content into the box and say select check plagiarism. Once we have done that, it would be doing its checks to make sure that there is no plagiarized content in what is being proposed. And so far we see that the content is unique, so we are all clear in terms of publishing this content. So we're gonna head back over to the main page that we were on, right? Once you are here, we're gonna go back to the text box and we're gonna look at another avenue that you can use this artificial intelligence for. Create crossword puzzle words or let's say world leaders. And you see that enter. You can see the suggestions are immediate here. You want to create a puzzle. So let's not be puzzle. Create a word search for mouse. All right, so we're creating a word search for animals, and we can just scroll down, and we will see what would be the suggestions. Right, so they gave us a list of animals that we can include in the word search. So this again makes it easier for us to generate our low content books in word search, in crossword puzzles, and if we are doing short stories. So guys, continue to explore this platform because the avenues available are extensive and it can effectively assist you in creating your low content books and in your publishing process. Thank you for listening to Everyday Life and Money Matters. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Drop a comment and click that notification bell so you can be alerted of all our videos. Thanks for viewing.